Hello everyone, my name is David Naidel from Blue Feather, and I wanted to take some time today to show you our new accordion table solution for FileMaker. Um, we've had lots of people uh, asking us, and we've seen comments online as well, about people wanting to have expandable portal rows or nested portals or expandable list views. Um, so we wanted to make a solution that will solve that problem. Uh, this solution uses HTML, CSS, and JavaScript in a web viewer. Um, we provide you with a block of HTML that you can use and substitute in your data uh, to create these expandable tables. Um, an accordion table lets you see more data in line without having to leave your list view or portal. So for example, uh, this is the sample projects file that that is included with FileMaker, one of the templates. And in this, if we wanted to have a, uh, a you know a list here, we can we can pick a project in this case, a new website, and see a list of files in here. We can click to drill down into this. You know, we can go from the list view to the project to services and drill down into it. Um, but sometimes you want to be able to see that information without leaving the page. And so an accordion table allows you to do that. Um, so here we have uh, you know, a, a set of companies, and I'm going to click on one of these. And this expands to show projects that are in process for this company. So I clicked on Blue Feather here and expanded to show a cool new web app. Um, in the accordion table, I can click to expand and collapse these rows and see into these directly uh, from the from the portal on the layout, or in this case what it is is technically a web viewer. Um, I can even use the new uh, JavaScript integration in FileMaker 19 to trigger scripts from inside here. So if I click on view on this project, I can open up a detail card window where I can make changes to it. So I'm going to change this from in progress to complete and hit close. And I set that and it updates the web viewer with the correct data in the table now showing that this is complete. Um, this is a great way to kind of give your users a, diff a very different user interface um, from what's been possible to do before. In addition to letting you see the data and click to expand, uh, here we're clicking into this and we have one level of depth. Uh, we can actually do multiple levels. So here I've loaded a different set of data into my accordion table. And this one, I'm going to select Blue Feather again. This expands to show some projects. And I can expand into these a second time. In this case, I'm picking a company a project. And now we're seeing some details about the project. I can also choose to have some items have multiple levels of nesting, or some only have one level of nesting. You can show different contents within each of the child tables on whichever level of depth you want to see. Uh, we can even have something completely different, in this case, for Blue Feather, we're showing projects, but for Acmeco, we're going to show some flavors of ice cream. And now you can see here that these rows are colored based on the ice cream flavor that we've picked. And that's due to custom CSS styling that we've put uh, into this field on the left side here. Uh, the accordion tables are built and designed for you to customize these themes uh, to make them match your use case and your interface in your FileMaker database. Our demo file also includes a number of different example themes uh, so that you can kind of get some ideas about how things might look with different configurations. I hope you've enjoyed this quick demo, uh, and we invite you to go to bluefeathergroup.com slash docs to see the full documentation for creating accordion tables like this, and to download a copy of this demo file. Thank you very much.